Welcome to my beautiful country, Antigua and Barbuda, and the wonderful surviving Richards Cricket Stadium for the CG Insurance ODI, West Indies versus Sri Lanka. Pulled away, too short from Jason Holder. Sat up nicely. This is a man in form, Gunatilika. Chopped on. So an early wicket for the West Indies. Slightly soft dismissal, you would say. And the captain has to go. The mood, Karuna Ratna. Picked up and goes all the way for six. A little bit wayward, a little bit too straight from Jason Holder. Chopped on. Second wicket now to Alzari Joseph. His consistency in lengths and lines paying dividends. Certainly look a different bowler today than he did in the first ODI. Really on target. Very good. Very good. Hit with the wind. The ability of Gunotilica to pick length early is brilliant. Akil Hussain gets the wicket. The safe hands of Jason Holder. And Fernando's entrance to the team is short. Welcome with a boundary from Gunatilika. Just seemed to have picked that length early enough and he's favoring uh, that portion of the field here. Goes over the offside this time. Gets enough on it. Challenges the boundary, gets there. So another boundary for Gunatilika. Inside edge goes down towards the fine leg boundary. Misses it. Gets his 50 in the end. Gunatilika, his 10th half century in one day international cricket and consecutive half centuries on this tour so far. Goes for a big shot, Gunatilika, and gets it. And this time he goes against the wind, but had enough on it to clear the boundary. Excellently driven down the ground by Chandimal. Authoritative and in control, and that will bring him some confidence. Well driven by Gunatilika. And shows his class. Didn't try to overhit that one. Just leaned to the front foot and placed it quite well. Another boundary for him. Pull away. Dinesh Chandamal this time. And gets it all the way over the boundary. A bit short from Fabian Allen. And got the treatment it deserved. Well, yeah. Clean him up. Jason Mohammed again makes the breakthrough. And the main wicket, the prize wicket of Gunatilika on 96. They know how important that wicket is for the West Indies. And there it is. His 23rd ODI half century. Dennis Chandimal playing the situation. And a solid innings from the right-hander. Oh. Use of the feet. Doesn't get to the pitch, but still goes for the shot. Romario Shepard takes a relatively simple catch. Yep, frustration for Bandara. Stop it. Just went through with the shot. Mohammed just offering a little more room here for Chandamal, and he makes use of it. Just evades the fielder. Goes for six. Dinesh Chandamal. 
Moves another gear in his batting. Get it. Should be taken, yep. An innocuous delivery, but he picked the field out. Dinesh Chandimal. Exceptional bowling from Mohamed. He really has lifted his game. It's one of the reasons Roger Harper, the chairman, said he got a place in the team ahead of someone like a Rustin Chase because of his off spin. Smashed down the ground from Tessera Pereira. And given length and given a treatment. Goes for a big shot. Hasaranga gets enough on it. And a much needed boundary. Much needed six for Sri Lanka. Too short from Alzari Joseph. In the air. Pollard settles. Doesn't get there. Despite his best efforts. Another six for Wanindu Hasaranga. This time out the bowling of Jason Holder. Up in the air. Pollard chases after it. Doesn't get there. Another boundary for Wanindu Hasaranga. Didn't happen. Good shot from Hasaranga. Moved quite early. Anticipated the length. And there was no accommodation from Romario Shepard. Brings up the 50 partnership. Excellent from these two in only 40 deliveries. Goes for a big one and gets the elevation that he was looking for. Hasaranga. Another six for him. Four sixes in innings so far from Wanindu Hasaranga. Pull away. Taken. Azari Joseph. A brilliant fielding. Hitting against the wind. Good bowling. Good planning. Good execution. Good result. Good flow, very low and straight. Look at that. Well done by Shea. Shea Hope as well. Well, it's up in the air. Akil Hussein drops it. Should have taken that catch, Akil Hussein. But it ends their innings, in Sri Lanka, and a flurry of boundaries towards the back end of their innings gets them to 273. There he goes, Evan Lewis. Elegantly placed and timed. And the first boundary for Lewis and the West Indies. Over the top from Shea Hope. Uncharacteristic, but gets the result he was looking for. No need to run for that one. Brings the over to an end. Three gone, 15 without loss. The mighty blow, because Lewis sits on his left leg in terms of equation of balance quite a lot. Often the pull shot is right in his arc. That has to be one of the more disdainful shots that you will see at any point today. 54 without loss, 50 up for West Indies. All the way for six, riding on the wind. That's it. It's 10 to ODI half century. Evan Lewis uh, showing consistency with the bat, backing up his half century of 65 in the first ODI. Here he is again, doing the business for the West Indies. Four sixes for Evan Lewis today and talk about the power hitting every so often. When it's needed, he branches into it. A fifth successive score of 50 or more in one day internationals for Shea Hope, dating back to the three ODIs against Sri Lanka in 2020. 
Another good strike by Shea Hope. This time back over the bowler's head. One bounce into the fence. Four runs. That is tremendous. Tussar Pereira has just been swept by Evan Lewis. And innings of authority and great responsibility by this left-handed West Indies opening batsman. The fourth ODI 100 for Evan Lewis. Yeah, he was going to try to put pressure on the bowlers and finally Sandakan gets his man. It's been a wonderful innings by Evan Lewis. Would be disappointed with the manner of the dismissal, but pleased with his score, Evan Lewis. Should be out. Bubbled. No one, Pradeep, takes the catch. I think that's part of the pressure of the run rate just creeping over. Seven per over required now as well with mid-off in the circle. With the wind and gone, we have liftoff. Got him. That's why that man was down there. So success for Tisara Pereira and Sri Lanka. There he goes. Kyron Pollard at his best. You cannot afford to do that. Right in the slot. And he's going to go. That's 10 from two deliveries. Loud appeal, loud appeal and given. Umpire Nigel Dugan raises the dreaded finger. Will Pollard review? He goes for it. Ball tracking is coming up. That's pitching in line, impacts in line, and the wicket's hitting. I'm going to go back to Nigel on the field. Nigel, stay with your original out decision. Captain Karen Pollard has to go. Gets it through. Desperate dive from short fine leg. Picked up sweetly. That's the power of Fabian Allen. He's a special player. Gets a six for the West Indies. There's a fielder, there's a fielder. He takes the catch. So wicket again for the Sri Lankans. And the West Indies, well, they go into some trouble now. Goes through the offside. Gets it right, Nicholas Puran gets a boundary. Goes downtown, Nicholas Puran. Ideal man for the situation. And he's proving it. Oh, that's powerful. That beats the sweep on the offside. That's a magnificent shot by Nicholas Puran. And he should get it. West Indies, they inch closer. Gets it away. That's a win for the West Indies. Nicholas Buran finishes things off. It's the highest successful run chase for the West Indies in ODIs against Sri Lanka. Victory for West Indies by five wickets. Two deliveries left. Congratulations all around. The run chase, Evan Lewis and Shea Hope put on 192 yet again doing very well at the top of the innings lewis getting to his fourth odi century jason holder just had to contribute two in that partnership of 25 
winning partnership to close the game out for the West Indies. Not a lot to talk about in terms of the bowling. Pasaranga, the, the, the premier spinner, wicketless again for the second time. And that is cause for concern. Indeed, they struggle to get uh, wickets at regular intervals. Uh, West Indies, they've been able to put a stop on the potency of the spin from the Sri Lankans and they've uh, complemented that with their batting as well. West Indies going on to win by five wickets and taking the series.